Hello everyone, this is the Great Pumpkin speaking and welcome to this new video about Fire Emblem Warriors. Last episode, we've gone to the desert and managed to find Mar, the Hero King, and now we're headed to the Dragon Stable, which is Chapter 5. Mar informs the party that a mage is helping the Gristone army resurrect the Chaos Dragon. Just as the legend says, Darius decides the party must go to the Dragon Stable to stop it. Let's begin the scenario. Chapter 5. The Dragon Stable We've almost reached the Dragon's Table. I wonder what Validar is planning. Me too. I guess we'll find out when we get there. Right, Robin? <sighs> Robin, are you okay? <sighs> yeah. Something's wrong. What's the matter? I just haven't been able to sleep well lately. Uh, my head! You don't look well at all. You probably need rest. You're right. I should probably sit out the next battle. You're in no shape to protect yourself. I'll stay back and keep an eye on you. Thanks, Krom. Hmm. We won't have to worry with Krom watching over you. You can leave the dragon's table to us. Actually, I've got something that needs my attention. What? You weren't going to fight with us? I'm sorry. I'll catch up with you later. <laughs> Very well. Come on, everyone. Prepare yourselves for the battle ahead. Okay, so the condition. Defeat mages and Validar. So there are a couple mages throughout the map and we'll need to defeat them all. Apparently on a strict time limit, apparently. Or whatever. Anyhow. So, let's see. And a condition, same as usual. As for the map deployment. Hmm. Who do I want where? And doing what? I could have Cordelia and Lissa deal with this uh, bit. She can go ahead and guard Cordelia, who is our first spear user. And here I can probably have Rowan back up uh, Frederick, who will be helping out for the most part. Leave it to me. Yeah, that sounds like a, like a good plan. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. <coughs> uh, no, that's Frederick that I want. Now, let's go stop Validar's twisted ritual. I received a report. The walls are impenetrable as long as the dark barrier stands. Someone must be powering that barrier. Let's keep an eye out as we fight. Okay, that's why we need to deal with the mages. There we go. Little dude is gonna get here eventually. Although we do have a soldier over here. The gates to reach certain areas here. Let's go. Ah, that was pretty awesome. All right, here you are, little dude. It looks like there are areas only can reach by cases. Hmm. That's helpful. One of the things that bothers me is that the mount aren't exactly as good to fight as they are in their usual Dynasty Warriors. I can take out fodder as I run along. Although I'll admit, Frederick is a little tougher. Anyhow, flight routes are a path through the battlefield that are only accessible to flying units. They're marked on the minimap by a wing and arrows. You can cross gaps by approaching fly flight routes as a flying unit and pressing B. The flying unit can also pass over flight routes when given the order orders. Flying units can carry regular units over flight routes by using pair up. That makes sense. That's actually a pretty good idea and a good way to handle flight. I'm impressed. Not 
not to be trifled with. Faction of Griston is advancing. I'll try if I found out where they are. And there's a turret too. Someone is being attacked. We have to help out. The mission starting. Defeat the soldier and rescue the turret. Out of my way, you. Frederick is all kinds of badass unlike in the main game. Usually Frederick is one of those units who is of an advanced class and is just there to teach you uh, how the game works basically. So, uh, he's also fairly useful on higher difficulties being that uh, most of the enemies are so top that he can actually shield weaker units. One of the challenges is actually making sure that he doesn't get too much experience as he has pretty bad growth overall. Poison? Sounds like I really missed something somewhere. And why the heck is Cordelia out to help us? Um. Boy, am I confused right now. Seems we'll need to break through the gates to reach certain areas here. Let's go. Have a deal. Just leave it to me. Together we can do this. Will you join me? Let's get them together, Frederick. You're no match for the both of us. Archers, eh? Makes you wonder what's down there, though. I hope it's not an archer, because that would be really bad for Cordelia. These archers have really weird hats, so I kinda dig them. Sounds like they put archers at places where there were actually flight paths, so you need to clear them so Cordelia can get through. That actually makes a lot of sense. Out of my way, you. I'll go. By the way, I keep talking about the difference between this and Dynasty Warriors, which is fairly understandable because I actually started with the Dynasty Warrior 8 XL, although I do have a couple of videos of me playing that, so if you want to see the difference, that can be cool. I don't have any Fire Emblems, though. That was before I got uh, a capture card. And I don't think I have anything to play the DS versions, unfortunately. But I have to check to see what I can do. Show me the power of a knight. As you wish. Observe well. Do you really think you can beat us? Rowan is actually a good choice against this mage. Well, as much as he can be anyway. Out of my way, we weaklings. I was gonna say scrub, but uh, yeah. That's one heck of a move there. Thinking we're gonna finish cleaning up a bit here and then we'll move on with Cordelia. 
Swap with Frederick. Move to Cordelia. Getting somebody to help us out would be helpful. Huh. That's pretty cool as far as her aerial hits go. Wow, that's all kinds of awesome. Could see myself liking this quite a bit. X-Men's are powerful against Pegasus Knights, that's no good for us. We've kind of glitched the camera, didn't we? Oh well. We've got vulneraries if needs be. Huh. She can even fly around the battlefield. That's actually pretty darn cool. Unwieldy deal. Which is why it's important to have a buddy. A Myrmidon? Huh. I've got a spear. Woo! Fancy! So let's see. We do have Lysa here. She could do the job. Here we go. One other idea that would be good would be to unpair up those guys. I didn't think this would be so difficult. That's not bad. So let's see, it's a fort captain who is... Oh, I thought it was a knight for a second there. Let's clean up, shall we? Oh, pretty neat. Ow! So she has no vulneraries on her. Let's see. Help me out, Lisa. What do you mean I can't? So where is she now? You idiot, get back here. Well, she's full of health now, anyway. Probably switching character, actually, ended up uh, healing her. Oh well. That's good, I suppose. Okay, get back here. Or maybe it's a level up. Okay, pop up shop. Let's get to it. Could actually just go with Frederick and let them just do whatever. Take some degree of skills to get all so many soldiers jumping around like that. Not a memento. We've got somebody here who might attack the fort. We'd better deal with this dude. Huh. Nice dive there. Ooh, sweet. She doesn't do a lot of damage though. I suppose like regular Pegasus warriors. They are mostly used to take out uh, enemies that were getting weak a little. Or, I don't know, 
Lone Swordsman, I suppose. What do we have? Spearman, eh? Oops, wrong one. Well, that'll work just as well. I barely saw anything, but that was awesome. There's Mage. Pegasus Knights are resistant to magic, I think. That should work. Kinda alright. Awesome. We could use a bit of help though, the other guys won't really be able to help us at all. Let's see what we can do. Yes, sir. I do would like them to handle that. Put me in. Leave it to me. Not really making any headways like this. Excellent. Right. What should I do next? Excellent. Give me another target. from their misery. Kill them all! Okay, their forces are advancing. I don't particularly care. What do we have here? Spearmen, eh? Quit falling under your ass, Lysa. Huh. That's all kinds of awesome. Okay, let's leave Lysa there or we're gonna go get our backups from the other side. Put me in. Hey, you get here. Leave it to me. What part of attack don't you understand? Oh, but it's Myrmidons. That's not a good idea. Quit running away, you idiot. Yes, sir. Oh, they can actually move through there. Oh. Put me in. Well then I don't care. Leave it to me. Yes, sir. Roger. And it will have been a heck of a failure of a battle. Dario's advancing. Sounds like strong attacks are the way to go with them. Weak attacks aren't really doing anything for me. Holy! You were 
told to watch out for some sort of poison fog, were we not? If an enemy looks suspicious, don't let it escape. There are strange tactics afoot. The mission starting. Defeat the mage of the poison fog. Yeah, she had to leave so, so that leaf heals she needs to show off. Knock some sense into Robin. You're the boss. Got a new objective. Our allies are on their way. I thought yeah. you were acting strangely, and this proves it. I must protect him. I like those profit margins. Oh. You traitor. If we can lower the drawbridge, we might be able to return to the fort from here. Huh. This kind of looked like she's commanding a squad of Pegasus Knights. That's a nice touch. A couple of characters in the series actually did exactly that. So drawbridge. No matter. Kill every last soldier of the Aetolesian army. I see enemy reinforcements. What? Well, I can't be everywhere. Put me in. Leave it to me. Fend crown. Too many of them. Gotta go help him. That's one heck of a reversal. I'm here to help. Poison fog. Certain enemies are able to contaminate the battlefield with poison fog. It shows up in purple on your minimap and will damage any unit in the area. To get rid of poison fog, you must strike down and defeat the enemy mage controlling it. That's interesting. Although Frederick is being a complete yes, idiot. Roger. You go there and guard it. <laughs> Embrace of poisonous demise. How could this happen? We knew it was a trap, and yet we were still ensnared. That's because you're an idiot, bit Frederick. Wow, armor knights. I didn't expect that. 
Por otro lado. That's a heck of a move. I don't think I've actually seen any uh, special move with units appearing and uh, armor knights showing up in great number. Usually they're kept like, I don't know, to defend strong points and so on. Never as an ambush. Yeah, I know. Stop whining. We can't let our allies fall to this poison fog. Let's take out that mage now. We've got to hurry. First thing first, drawbridge. You? Yes, sir. Defend me. Roger. Put me in. You stop messing around and come help us. Leave it to me. Stereo's gonna be able to take this. I don't know. Drawbridge. Honestly, I think I'm gonna fail that mission. Poison fog is taken care of. Everyone on the bus. The fog seems to have finally cleared. Thank you. You cannot undo what is already done. Now then, surrender to your doom. Kind of a one-trick pony, is he? think so how can I do how do they say that I disagree <laughs> Aren't you persistent? Ooh, master seal God, I must retreat but I cannot accept this as fated Robin is back to normal and we beat the enemy general looks like a victory we should seal this altar so it can never be used for this ceremony again. Thanks to you all, we stopped the ceremony in time. And if that's the case, I won't be needing this mask anymore. Uh -huh. In truth, my name is Lucina. I hail from the same world as Krom. Well, I guess our worlds aren't exactly the same. Where we are from, the situation is rather dire. It's a grim future yet to unfold. You're from the future? Huh? Wait, but you said we. Who else came with you? Ha! The hero's origin unveiled at last. Hark! The blood of the virtuous few enriches my veins as well. Blood that I share with another. A gentle soul set adrift Let's on the- Let's get to the point. Okay. Long story short, Liz is gonna be my mom. Wait! Uh, what? 
That's right, Mother. I'm your loving son from a far-flung future. But how to prove the truth of my words? Of course, I'll share a secret that only your child would know. No, stop right there, Owen. No this secrets, says, because I believe you. Son? But Mother, you need to know Whoa, your soul that I'm not flesh and blood. Are you still talking? Uh, Lucina. the brand. Could it be? <laughs> Hello, Father. <sighs> Better, Lucina? Yes, Father. Father? Should... should I call you something else? No, it's just strange to my ear. I like it. Crumb! Lucina! You got a minute? Pardon the intrusion, my lord, but the last patrol returned with vital information. They reported a fierce battle between two armies we've never seen before. Could they be people who came through the portals like we did? If that's the case, then there could be a hero from another world with them, too. Hold on. We could get pulled into their war if we do this wrong. Ha! <laughs> a power above must favor our quest! The solution has revealed itself! What solution do you mean, Owain? What are you saying? Owain, speak plainly. Oh, um, uh, maybe we split up and approach both sides at the same time? If we split our forces and a battle breaks out, we would be in serious trouble. But a smaller force would be able to move about unnoticed. Time is critical. Let's take the risk and split into two groups. So yeah, really big spoiler about the story of Fire Emblem Awakening there. So actually, it was never Mart, it was Lucina, Crom's daughter from the future. <laughs> so yeah, actually think they did that really well. Almost better than they in the 3DS version. And also, well, Owain shut up. <laughs> okay. MVP is Cordelia. I suppose she deserved it. I'm kind of critical of the fact that she didn't deal that much damage. She's probably low level. Level 13. Now I must do it again. Not by much, but her strength seems rather low. We acquired a new weapon, the Iron Tome. Other than that, doesn't seem to be really anything. As well as a Master Seal. You can use a Master Seal to create a Surge Crest at the Crest Market and change to an Advanced Class. This is a Master Seal, special item used to craft a Surge Crest. You need Surge Crest to advance a unit to the next class. There are a limited number of Master Seals available, so they are extremely valuable. Try to collect them all so you will have enough for all your allies. If you find a Master Seal in battle, it will be added to the convoy automatically. So yeah, that is cool. And another one, and this looked like Validar's face. Would have thought. I want to get to know you much better. It feels nice to bond like this. Ah, girl stall. Good for them. You got Lysa's nest egg first, and Cordelia's wing hairpins. I'm counting on you. Liana is now playable. Fights with sword techniques inherited by royalty. Vary the attack style, facilitate combat adaptability. Press starring attack repeatedly for continued strikes. Leave it to me. Robin is now playable. Employs powerful magic to control a wide area. Mix magic types and enemies flying. Attack adds us to a special gauge that strengthens strong attack 1. Hmm. Come back safe. Lucina is now playable. Fights with the own sword style of a true veteran. Swift movement leaves no opening for foes. Charge strong attack 1 for a powerful strike. Starting to think she might actually just be a sort of palette swap for Krom. I may be wrong though. Something new has been added. The temple opened within your camp. You can now play history mode. Invisible ties was added to history mode. Okay, so we've got two choice. Chapter 6 and chapter 9. We'll probably do them in order. Anyhow, camp. Welcome, welcome. What do you think? Temple. So we can do weapons blessing, mildly boost the rate of weapon drops, 
Mildly boosts the quality of drop weapons. Hmm. Interesting. So there is that now, the Crest Market. We can actually upgrade someone who is above level 15. Do I actually have one that's th that's that high? Don't be a stranger. I don't think so. We have Crom Rowan. The other guys are a little low. We might have to pay for some training if we're going to use them. Anyhow, I'm afraid that's going to be it for the time being. Thank you for watching, everyone. If you like what you're seeing, please subscribe. Please leave a comment below. And that was the Great Pumpkin. You all have a pleasant time now. Bye-bye.